Hi, this is Eric Yates, and we're going to take a look at how to change the default font in Smart Notebook. Before we do that, there's one quick thing I need to tell you. A lot of us try to click the A button in the toolbar and start typing, but here's something more interesting. Remember that arrow or pointer, pointer tool that you should always click in the middle of the toolbar? Well, use that to just click where you want type to appear and do this, start typing. All right, and there you go. You've got your text. Of course, it's Times New Roman and it's tiny, not to mention boring. So what are we going to do about that? I want to change my default font setting. Where is my default font setting? Well, it is in that A or text tool in the very first block here. We have here six different font settings that you could have, and they are uh, all font settings that you can set, but the first one is the default setting, and we need to change that. So with that one clicked or highlighted, let's go over to the properties tab here, the A with the colors, click that one time, and I'm going to go to text style and pick something I like. I happen to like the Arial rounded MG bold that looks kind of like a chart paper pen, and I'm going to pick something nice and big, like 20, and see what happens. Oh, by the way, I also like blue, so I'm going to select line style and then pick a blue color. Now down at the bottom, if you notice, you'll see something that says save tool properties. Click that and then look at that default box in the text tool. Check it out. It's Arial rounded and blue. So I'm going to go back to my pointer tool, click in my work area and start typing. Uh, Right. And you can see it's it's a good size, it's readable, and I can enlarge it very easily. It looks a lot better. I have less work to do. So that's how you set your default font setting in Smart Notebook. I hope that helps you out. And if you have any questions, don't hesitate to email Eric Yates, eyates at chatham-nj.org.